In this video, we're going to take a look at the creation of fillets in the 3D mode of AutoCAD. Here you can see I have a part and I want to add in some filleted corners on several of these corners here. And while I do have my traditional fillet command available on the modify panel, I have a specific one for 3D solids that works a little better on the solid tab. So on the solid tab, I'll go to the solid editing panel and choose fillet edge. For this one, it's very similar to the regular fillet command in that I want to set my radius first. So I'm going to go with radius here in the command line, and maybe I'll go with a quarter inch for this one. Then it's going to ask me to select an edge. So I'll just simply pick an edge here. It'll preview it. I'll press enter to accept it, and then enter one more time to finish it. And there you can see the fillet has been added. I'll go ahead and create the fill it again one more time here. So I'll go ahead and select an edge, press enter twice. And as you can see, you can just kind of repeat the same workflow here. Just have to hit enter twice each time that you place a fillet. Now you can see that I've got a set of tangent edges here and I want to fill it those all at once. So I'm going to choose fillet edge again. And this time I'm going to choose chain. I'll go ahead and pick one of the edges in that chain. Then I will press enter twice, and as you can see, it went ahead and filleted that continuous chain. So we'll see that one more time, fill it an edge. I'll go ahead and choose chain, select it, enter twice, and you can see it filleted that entire chain. To recap, the 3D fillet command works pretty similar to the normal 2D fillet in that we want to set our radius first and we just have to hit enter twice when we're creating the fillets in the 3D environment. That concludes this look at the 3D fillet tool in AutoCAD.